Hey, you've never injured it, like playing hockey. You've never no, had a fall against nothing, it. Nothing, man. I mean, just probably from impact. Okay. You know, a well, times. Okay. <laughs> so there's there's another thing you can do with these devices to tell whether you've got a previous injury that has been stored as a memory in your brain. I don't think you have one, but I'm going to test you. So we we'll use this arm because we know it's very consistent. So you just look straight ahead. I'm going to go on your sternoclavicular joint and just hold a device against it. Now push up. Nothing. And I'm going to go on your AC joint right here and now push up against. No, you have, you've got an AC. Try again. See. <laughs> Don't tell me that. <laughs> See, right there. You feel that right there? Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay push up. Okay, you see how weak you are? Yeah, yeah. All right. I don't like that. <laughs> you don't like that? I don't like that. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna make that go away. So what you do is you clip one you clip put one clip on the talotibial joint and then you rub the the area that we've located as a previous injury with a another clip. And that just removes it. Right. It's so gone. It, it does, yeah. And there are many. One time? One time, yeah. And I'll have to do it again? No. no. <laughs> nice. Not for removing the previous uh, memory of a trauma. So I think maybe over the years of hitting balls, multiple injury, multiple impacts of the AC joint right here yeah. may have set up this injury recall pathway. The, the technique is called injury recall technique. It was discovered in the early 80s that people store a memory of their trauma and uh, it, then your whole nervous system adjusts to that in every activity you do. It just, you know, for instance, if, if you were traumatized here uh, a long, long time ago and uh, your brain says, no, don't go any further because I've got a trauma memorized, so you, you might start to lift your shoulder this way instead of lifting your shoulder this way for the rest of your life. Mm. So your brain will keep a memory of that trauma and perhaps change the biomechanics of this. Anyway, yeah, don't know if, that's sure. your, if that is in your case, the situation, but we have found a memory of a trauma here and I've erased it and hopefully it will help to loosen things up. There's probably a bunch of other things I could work on. <laughs> work on them all, man. <laughs> okay. okay.